Okay, the mobile moves off. We've got two on the gate, Dakota Rebel and Good Time Blackie. Here the Thunder's off the track and always Betty. Now always Betty's gone for a gallop as Good Time Blackie now fills its spot. Galloping out the back, always Betty. Mobile comes into the home straight. Won't be long before they're away. Green for go. Good time Blackie on the inside was one of the best to begin. It leads from Dakota Rebel. And Dakota Rebel looks as though he wants to take the control of the race, and it does so. So Dakota Rebel hits the lead. Always Betty at the back of the fields in a mad gallop. It's been pulled out of the event. As they go in between turns on the bottom side of the track, and Dakota Rebel is leading the way. Second at this stage was Good Time Blackie, and here the Thunder is at the tail of the field, and we said goodbye to Always Betty. It uh, didn't want to do a thing tonight. It was on its worst behaviour. Lead time, 32.1. Dakota Rebel leads them down the back. I assume they'll be in this position for a long time. Good Time Blackie sitting in behind the leader, and here the Thunder. And then there's a margin of about 50 metres back to the... Mobile, who's starting to lose control the back of the field. Anyway, they come down towards the 1,200 metre marker now and Dakota Rebel out in front. Still leads by five metres over Good Time Blackie and here the Thunder at the tail, 31.3. And they're not moving along too badly for uh, a 2,000 metre trial. And Dakota Rebel showing them a clean pair of plates as it comes down with 1,000 metres to go. Sitting in behind the leader, Good Time Blackie. He's been in there for a while. They left something to offer in the finish. And here the Thunder, it's uh, racing a lot more tractably tonight at the tail of the field. They head out of the straight, down in between turns towards the 800 metre marker, and they go through that mark in 30.9. So Dakota Rebel still leads that way, 62.2 for the half. Dakota Rebel leading Good Time Blackie, and here the Thunder, and we lost uh, Always Betty not long after they jumped. Good Time Blackie pulls out to make a run now and gets uh, within two metres of the leader. Dakota Rebel still holding the pegs. Good Time Blackie on its outside. Here the Thunder is going to follow Good Time Blackie home. Past Nevliar stud the final time and inside the 400 metre marker in 29.8. Dakota Rebel still leads by two metres over Good Time Blackie. Here the Thunder goes down to the inside now to uh, look for, for a run. But as they come around the home turn, Dakota Rebel still out in front. Good time, Blackie can't get to it at this stage. Hear the thunder along the inside. As they come down with about 50 metres to go, it is still Dakota Rebel out in front. Good time, Blackie can't make it. And Dakota Rebel takes it out by two metres over good time, Blackie, and hear the thunder. Finished a very close third. Always Betty, gone after the start. 233.5. 29.2 for the last quarter. Third quarter, 29. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, details now after trial six, the 2030 metre trial. First home, number three, Dakota Rebel. First out, first home for Jess Dart. Nice even quarters there. Second home, good time, Blackie. Pulled out to make his run at about the 500 metre marker and just couldn't get there. And third home was number four here, the Thunder. And we lost always Betty just after the start. Overall time was 233.5 and the margins were two metres by two. The sections were 31.3, 30.9, down the back in 29.8, home in 29.2 and the mile rate is...
Okay, mole rate is 21.7. 21.7 for that mole rate. 